God damn. What the f is that? V, you look busy. You're hard at work. What are you doing? Printing labels. And it's very important to say stock controller Kelly is rated 300 phase amps. It's not rated 300 DC amps because there is some people out there they claiming that they have tuned on their stock more controllers 20 kilowatts. That's a lie. So where am I going today? I'm off to meet up with the guys from Powerful Lithium. What you doing? What you got there? Oh, I got here a uh, 8 kilowatt motor for Onyx RCR. Why orange? Yes, that's my Orange, question. whoever worked with uh, QS company, they know QS installing orange wires for high powered motors, which means Thicker phase wires because this is 8 kilowatt custom 3T QS 273. When you go to look for QS 273, you will find maybe 3.5T, 4T, 5T, like torquey motors. We asked for customization for 3T to provide higher top end because three, three turns means higher top, uh, top end. If you have 3.5 turns or four turns or five turns, that means you're gonna have um, a crazy torque, but very low to top end speed. So now with this motor, we're securing higher top end. Also, another thing you, see, you can see here, it's 1.85 rim wide. Star Conix uh, rim is 1.6. We did this on, this on purpose because usually people changing their swing arms into or extended swing arms, the wider uh, swing arms. So from this point, you can easily mount wider tire. And also even stock tire, when you have to install on this rim, it's easier because rim is wider than stock rim that is, which is 1.6 inches. And also you see that is uh, straight spokes. Straight spokes is strictly because there is no room between the rim and motor to have crossed spokes. We did a lot of research before we, la we, we started with selling publicly this motor. Those models we have on, on our testings for over a year. You've been here when we used to install those motors. We've been testing them, they're performing amazing. Even when people having a stock controller, let's say Kelly 300 amps, that's phase amps. So uh, even with them, uh, we have on our shop bike, we have uh, 64 miles an hour speed when we tune up, uh, tune on that controller. So even for that, it's also, also getting some better performance. And very important part, those motors is hard to hit, to overheat. That's main thing. I wish that, that we can slip this, sl slap this motor on Super 73s or something like that, or Bandit or, you know, all those bikes that we're doing upgrades, that people doing upgrades, we supply them with parts. I wish that we can have something like this. When you push this motor 13, uh, uh, 14 kilowatts which means 200 dc amps 200 uh, battery amps that's a lot that's like crazy torque like crazy speed this motor doesn't feel that i used to ride our onyx shop shop bike with a uh, eight kilowatt motor absolutely you can touch motor it's not hot even under my load and i'm heavy you know and i like to pin throttle so 
this is game changer especially like uh we've been seeing on stock controller when people bump up the tune because stock bikes stock onyx is amazing 50 55 miles an hour you're hitting and you can also increase your torque and speed a little bit and because tune came already from the factory from the onyx around 50 percent only you're using only 50 percent of capabilities of that controller that controller when you tune up you have good torque and better speed which sometimes happening that people having issues with overheating of their three kilowatts motor when they do that so from this point you can max your tune this motor handling that easy good update upgrade and amazing performance and it's very important to say stock controller kelly is rated 300 phase amps it's not rated 300 dc amps because there is some people out there they claiming that they have tune on their stock more controllers 20 kilowatts and they calling some crazy names those tunes or something like that that's a lie so 300 phase amps means around 100 120 uh, dc amps maybe 140 max oh, that's important that's very important so that's battery amps 120 max or even 100 that's the rated 300 what the, what they say on that controller 300 is phase amps it's not dc amps so even if it's 300 amps so your max tune if it's dc amps 300 you will have max tune 21 kilowatt but in this case when you have 100 or 120 uh, amps uh, kelly controller it's uh basically you're pushing seven to nine kilowatts that's it of course people's been seeing like when you hit the throttle you can see just for like millisecond seems like you're peaking 15 uh thousand watts but that disappears like in in millisecond that's just like a peak a little bit but you're not pushing those amps you're not pushing those amps so it's very important to say that uh with kelly controller which is I excellent controller so efficiency is amazing on that controller because those 300 amps phase amps those 300 phase amps they really moving like you you feel that power you feel that kick you feel that how a um, uh, bike picking up like start doing wheelie when you have proper tune but definitely way lower low than uh, 20 kilowatts when some people claiming out there that is you know they have special tunes or something like that that's one huge lie people stop uh trust those guys who claiming that they have 20 kilowatt it's impossible how you can get 20 kilowatts look why are we changing into far drivers now because far driver let's say for example has battery amps 350 amps and phase amps 680 680 so you're pulling 350 amps from battery to convert into 680 phase amps so think about when you have kelly controller that say 300 phase amps how much amps from the battery you're pulling 100 120 so 100 amps times 72 volt is 7.2 kilowatt or 70 uh, 7200 watts so math is clear just follow the math nobody need to be me or anyone else too smart here just do math and everything will be set that's it so if somebody wants to pick up one of these where can they find them we have them actually on our website listed there like i said earlier we've been waiting for so long before we release them on website because we wanted to make sure that those models is reliable and good for everyone because we don't want to sell anyone something that they're gonna have problem in like month or two we really want to have good product same as our batteries amazing batteries amazing products and we're standing behind our products we're standing behind ourselves, builds, and 
uh, proper BMS, very important. So safety precautions on the first place, first that, and then sale, then installation, then everything else. For us, safety first, and then everything else. So if you guys are familiar with powerful lithium, you, like me, already know that they build batteries. But they're quickly becoming something else. All right, so there you go. This is just a taste of what's in store. If you guys enjoyed what you saw, please don't hesitate. Smash the like button. Leave a comment, because I get back to everybody. And if you want to, please subscribe. So until the next video, peace out, everybody. medicine doctors it's we are doctors for e-bikes thank you so from the water to the mat like that again bro trying to record or you gonna talk tell tell you bro i have no problem but you're trying five times to record